and it's really interesting to see how much softer the leaf elf spring is in in this grouping uh, because this is made by subaru and kind of like this is the kind of the accepted to be the like the best the standard what have you i benchmarked the the tokyo Roki sti filter um, what's interesting is the highest relief valve pressure that we found was the was the super temporary filter and then in this grouping they all varied from from the tokyo Roki. And it's really interesting to see how much softer the relief valve spring is in, in this grouping. Um, you've got the, the STI, the, uh, sorry, the Roger Clark, the STI, and the HKS, they're all in the same ballpark um, of about, you know, 40%, 45% softer than, than the Tokiroki. And then you've got the Cusco and the Bretti, which are softer still. They're like 60% softer, which is really interesting. Now the question that we have, which is probably the question that you have, which is, what does all of this mean? Again, I think the Tokiroki filter is a good baseline because it was standard on these cars for so many years. But the other thing that I, that I take away from all of this is that I think that how you, how you use the engine, how you drive the car is a really big piece of the puzzle when it comes to which filter is right for you. And this relates in part to the leaf valve pressure.